Welcome back to Game Master, your master the Frick Master. Welcome back to Nagon Country Let's Play. This is probably most likely the last part of the Let's Play as we'll finish off the Chimp, chimp Caverns and uh, earn our spot to fight the final boss. So since it's only like this, there's only two levels left. This one, the, this one, next one, and there's two boss fights. So yeah, we're pretty much almost done with this game. <laughs> this is definitely it. <laughs> I'll get my thoughts when the credits roll. That uh, works. I can get. I get too deep in yet. These two are definitely okay. This one definitely is kind of hard. The next one really isn't that hard if you're, you know, somewhat good at platforming, which this, which is point of the game you probably should be. Which means it's quite gonna hold me wrong, but like for me. Okay, that's uh, that's so bad. Keep it on for now. That's unfortunate. Yeah, so now I managed to get out of it. <laughs> yep, that, 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 yep, I totally, totally was not guessing. I wasn't showing my pants in the background here. <laughs> you know what? You know what to tell at this point. He's joking. <laughs> I don't know why I'm bothering this anymore. Oh, I see what happened here. What? How is? There. Okay. So the tire's longer there now. Woohoo! The tire is gone. I can't really see. There, hold on, let's do this. Okay, then I need, I need his barrel for what's coming up next. Oh yeah, <laughs> gotta do it in the dark, baby. Uh, yeah, okay, yeah, sure. <laughs> You see, I'm just that good in the dark, you know. <laughs> I, I like I have the ultra dark vision, and I'm not I'm not just hold, not blatantly guessing in the wild, hoping I'm correct. Those would be. I don't know why I thought they were those are crocodiles. That was telling me. Okay, we made it. Oh, I forgot about the freaking barrel guy. Forget he's here. Last time we've seen him, I believe. I don't need it. Whatever that is, I don't need it. Yeah, it's over. We'll open a nice seven because I don't want to do any of that shit again. We should be at 97. Yes, we are. Okay, good. Only two more scores are fine. We pretty much have this game beat. The first one... Oh, for crying out. Actually, I don't know why. Just, just, just start over. I, I wasn't feeling that one. was will take it over. Start over. I wasn't feeling it. Ugh. All right, let's platform over here. Tis barrel and booyah. Alright, let's stem response. I mean I knew this, I knew this also wouldn't take that long to do, but now I really don't know what I want to do next. Like there's plenty of games I want to do, but I'm not sure what point I want to do them as a thing. Uh, I'll think about it. It could be next on country game, it could be another thing, it could be something else entirely. <sighs> we'll cross that bridge and we'll get to it. Which is it now, so. Oh, so Secret Sensible are at the very beginning and the very end, so don't don't worry about, like, hunting for them. 
Except for like, you know, the Kate, the Kate, the Kong. That was pretty stupid. Whatever, I just brought it like a Kong later, later on anyway. What? There's no way I missed that platform, you son of a bitch. Yeah, I don't want to bother putting any small platforms, just gonna clear yourself at the end. I caution you against. Just. Just. Like, why? <laughs> I don't need a barrel anyway. Where the, where's the O at? I'm curious. Oh, there it is. Oh, oh boy. Yeah, I'm trying to focus right now because this one's also kind of hard. This one's also pretty hard as well because there's a lot of these platforms. But though this, though this, this is kind of disappointing, this is kind of disappointing final, final level. You're choosing your final level, you probably should pull up all, pull up all the stops, except not really here. Let's throw one. Oh yeah, it is the wrong one. Just, this is. What was I thinking? Still the wrong one. Can you scare him? <laughs> it's super satisfying to do. Unfortunately, I am now caught in a situation where I must either try this again. There we go, okay. Problem solved, fixed it. For crying out loud. Fine, I guess it won't be Donkey Kong. God, it's so annoying. Wait, I need to go down here. Okay. And that's the last con. And this is the last secret. And I probably doesn't want to get this, so I don't want to do this all over again. Alright, so it's in this one, but I'm gonna go choose this one because I don't want to do it. Do it, to be honest with you. Oh no, I didn't complete the secret! Alright, alright, time, time for the boss fight. Oh yes, this neck guy's back at it again. Dodge his nuts. He's a lot more precise with his nuts this time. They can just do that. He, he shoots out. The more you hit him, the more he shoots out, so. Yeah. I think he's got like, just like six hits to do. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, I won. Yay! I remember, some reason I thought more that boss was lean a lot harder. Oh well. And guess what? We have enough time to do the final boss. Over there at Game Playing Galleon. King K rule with one of my favorite one of my favorite boss fights and themes in in, in the in the in this video history. Hey, no joke, I love I love game I love gameplay. Game 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 playing galleon. It's a pretty good theme. Da, 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 da. Fish one starts kicking in. That's the boss by itself, it's not particularly hard. At least for the first half. You can't really hit him on the crown on top of his head. Now the first phase is not hard, the second phase is really not either. Just wait for the candles to fall and he goes to cry on you. What that that's that just should not that not hit me. Mm 
Alright. Screw Crane again, K. Rule, I dare you. Uh, now, I don't know why it's just a random rivalry between Crocodile and Donkey Kong. It could be an allegory for King Kong vs. Godzilla, which I can't, which I could believe. But. <laughs> King K. Rule is certainly no Godzilla, let's put it that way. <laughs> though though Donkey Kong 4 does have a giant laser beam. And oh look, we won! We did it, guys! We beat the game! We are victorious! King K. Rule has been defeated. Let's talk of the credits, shall we? Let's both K for some reason. I don't know why. This must be the Celestic, I guess. I don't know. Alright, mate. How many of you were fooled? Full when this when you first played this part of the game? <laughs> How many of you were fooled? I know, I know I wasn't. <laughs> Because that DM with a question mark, he just tells me, yeah, he's not, he's not done yet. And now he begins his hopping. And he just takes, he takes two more hits. His hops get a little more erratic, or just... Oh, whoops. Oh, yeah, I forgot he does it twice in a row. I don't know, for some reason he thinks the bunny rabbit, I don't know why. That was stupid to me. And then he just does short hops for the last one. Wait for him to finish. And then one more time, you win! We are victorious! King K. Rule has been defeated, and we got ourselves the big one on us. Well done, Gunky, my boy! Who would have thought Yun Wipper like you could have beaten that bunch of no good Kremlins? You made an old con old man proud. Go and look in your hoard. I think you'll be in for a surprise. What a player you are, Donkey, my lad. You've beaten the Kremlins. And found absolutely everything. You're nearly as good as I used to be. Yep, we found all. We found everything and we got our bananas back. The quest for our bananas have been completed. <laughs> And now for the credits, where we just see the cast of characters coming through. Everyone we face the bad guys with all good stuff. And also this credit as well. In fact, go and say it. This is one of my favorite video game soundtracks out there. Almost every single thing is memorable for its own for for good reason. And it's for it's a and outside of like the mining I think I didn't really care for, but outside but yeah, this is great this is a good game. Graphics are nice for the time. Uh all those I, I like, I like it a lot, except for those very cryptic ass secrets. Controls are fine, except for, except for the, some of the animal friends being a little slippery to play with. But overall, this is a good game. You know, I would. It's it's harder than your more average platformer, especially towards the end. So I would recommend this to be your first platformer. But if you are a big fan of platformers, I recommend you get this one a shot. You know, it still has a lot of quality. That it still has like a lot of quality that holds up today. Though I will, one thing I recommend triple freeze first, but we're not gonna get to that game until a very, very long time, so. <laughs> but yeah, this is this was a good dunk on country. I think I'll give it like a good old 7 out of 10. That's what I'll, I'll give it. Okay, I'd be a little more generous. 7.5 out of 10. If it wasn't for the Crypto series and the fact that this wasn't really your first platformer. I would give it a, I would give it a higher score, but as for, as for it is, it still doesn't take away the fact it's still a good game. That maybe even a great game, even a classic a game, I would say it's a classic game. But yeah, I'm not sure what. Like I said, I'm not sure we're gonna take a tackle next. It could be Donkey Kong Country 2. It could be something else entirely. Only one way to find out. It'll be much later. Just gonna go ahead and use all the crafts of credits. Ungeared. Winky. Squats, which you only control for one level. <laughs> I do like this, like, end game real credits real thing. <laughs> of course, they kinda, they kinda like dragging, like, trying to drag it out a little bit cranky in that here. I don't know why I keep banging that cranky set every time he's on it. That's why it's going cranky. I don't know. Mm. 
Yeah, it celebrates. We did it. Uh, but yeah. This little, this little key little cutscene here. Yes, I, I, this evil slap personality too, which I'm not going to that way. I'm not sure Don Gunter might idiot more the fact that he's just not really... Not really, like, accustomed, I would say, by probably way of putting it. I didn't see him on I bet you did. Wait, what do you want? Wait... Wait, what do you want? What do you want? A, what do you want, a metal cranky? <laughs> Uh, not much, not very much left to do though, just with my credits are roll. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure, yeah. <laughs> it's like, like what I have like, nothing else to say. <laughs> uh, Mim Stevenson. Uh, I don't know what ob objects you put in the game, but you did something with the objects, and I'll give you that, you credit for that, I guess. <laughs> and this, uh, this credit scene is amazing. <laughs> I, it doesn't mean I've read very proud scene all the time. It's still going to be with Mario 64 because of the nostalgia factor, but yeah. <laughs> Eventually, it'll be all over. <laughs> Eventually. That's the time being, I guess, right now. I'll continue writing, finish up writing this. Writing, this is one, episode 24. Part of me wants us to take a break, too. I don't want to do that. <laughs> I really don't want to do that. Oh, rare, where'd you go? I mean, that was sort of thing, but... I felt like I was doing somewhere. Or, I'm even curious about what the next Donkey Kong are going to be like. I never seen like Nara Odyssey, which I hope, which I'll, I'll be knowing mine, but yeah. I think we're going to there. Thank you all for watching. If you're a master of the Frank Master, or continue mastering this game out in the next part. So, see you guys then.